Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I will show you step by step process how you can easily use RoboForm for your uh, passwords, card details, etc. Now there are a few options, so you can have a browser and you can have like the normal application. So we are, I'm going to show you the normal application first because this is the first step to actually install it. And now we have options like browse integrations where you want it. We'll go for Google Chrome. Next. And now where you want to install it, okay, install. Okay, it needs to like cancel the applications and Chrome. Okay. And now create a new account. Email. And I will just add here the password. Next. Little bit, little mistake right there. It's all right. It's all right. Okay, next. And now welcome to RoboForm. It's going to install. Next. And now it's going to install. Got it. Add to Chrome, add extension. And this is really important to have it for your Chrome. And now, RoboForm Editor, and voila, here we are. So we have like the desktop application right here. And what we can do is to also log in right here. On browser. Voila. And I can have logins here. But let's see and let me show you. So in here, you're going to see logins, you're going to see bookmarks, you're going to see applications. Like if you have for your in your computer, I don't know, Skype, identities, contacts that you can add, safe notes, shared and security center. If you see some duplicates reused, etc. Now, what you can do is simply click plus here. And now you're going to see it here, create a folder. If you want to. And here you can have a folder if you want. It would automatically like. Connect. So we go to Facebook and now we'll just add a password right here. Login. And now do you want RoboForm to save your password? Name Facebook, save. And this is how you can do it. And straight away you can see right here that you can add it to folder and you get a full. And this is same with applications. It's going to work like that. And identities and contacts. You can add it here or in applications. So these are the two ways how you can actually do it or add a simple contacts here. Right. Safe notes if you want to, everything and share it with other people. So this is pretty much it, how we can do it and how we can use it, right? And yeah.
If you have any questions, guys, ask me down in the comments. I'll be really happy to help you. Like using RoboForm is not that hard and it's really simple. And yeah, thank you very much. Have a great day and goodbye.